The Power BI desktop interface is divided into three main views. The report view, the data view, and the relationships view. The one we're looking at is the reports view. This is where you'll spend most of your time and it's where you'll create your finished product, your visualizations that you want to share with people. On the right hand side of the reports page, you'll find the fields, visualizations and filter options. And this is where you'll change all the options relating to any of the visuals that you've created. It also lets you create new visuals by clicking on one of the visualization options over here. The data view is where we can actually see the data that we've imported into our model. On the right hand side we see each of the tables that we've imported as well as any of the columns or metrics that we've created to summarize our data. Finally we have the relationships view and this is where we connect the various tables within our data model to make sure they can interact and work on our front end visuals as we would expect. We'll use the toolbar along the top to change some of the options throughout, but I'll guide you through that as we go. There is one other view that you'll be using frequently within Power BI, and that's the Power Query Editor. And that's what we're going to use to import any data that we want in the data model and to transform it in a way that we can analyze. I'll talk you through the Power Query Editor in more detail later on.